Hi, this is Josh with Resort TV One, and today we're going to be unboxing a Disney Magic Band Plus. We hope you enjoy the video. Please be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell if you haven't already done so. So let's go ahead and get started unboxing our Magic Band Plus. And as you can see, we got the fireworks one, really, really cool. Got the castle up here, kind of upside down. And then it's got the uh, Walt quote to all who come to this happy place, welcome. So cool. All right, so let's get started with the unboxing of it. We'll see what we can do here. All right, so here we go. I'm doing this on my computer desk, so you'll excuse the LG monitor in the background, but I've got it on a tripod here, so it'll be easier for me to do this with both hands. But super excited to check this out and uh, and see what's going on here. So I'll just open the end here and uh, pull the magic band out of the box. There we go. It will take a little effort to get it out because I think the, uh, the power cord was stuck there, but you can see the magic band there. And then on the back side, you can see it comes with a USB power cable. And it looks like it's wrapped around here. So we'll check that out here in just a second. And uh, I'm going to get a scissors here and cut these, cut these little plastic pieces so I don't damage it. But uh, really, really neat the way that it's, it's laid in here and um, just really neat presentation here. So, all right, so I went ahead and cut the plastic pieces off of the magic band there and then it just slides right out so let's take a look at it here so again I got this really cool fireworks design and there you can see the Walt Disney quote a little bit better uh, and then on the back side uh, you can see looks like the charging contacts here and then as we flip it back over again you can see back on the front so awesome so let's look at the charging, um, charging attachment itself. So let me get this USB cable out of here. There we go. I'm not going to save the box, so uh, it's okay if it rips just a little bit when I take it out of there. But okay, so the easiest way to get this little charging pad out of here is just to rotate it down into this little tab area here and then pull pull back and pull it out. That way you don't have to completely destroy the box. But here is the charger. I haven't seen a lot of videos show the charger. It reminds me just of the way it sits of an Apple Watch charger, but of course, let me get it focused again. Of course it's not because it's not that induction charging. It's not the wireless induction charging. It's actually uh, two metal contacts which contact with the backside of the Magic Band that I showed right here. So then, you know, it just goes right on there to charge like that so it looks like it just uh, looks like it just snaps right right in there all right so I got it a little positioned a little better now and you can hear there it just snaps right into place and then actually it stays on the uh, on the charger really nicely and then of course you just plug this part into uh, any USB power source and then to get it out all you had to do is push these uh, tabs and uh, and it just it just slides right out there so Pretty cool. And I also wanted to show you this little button on the back. If I push this little button here, everything lights up and I believe that's probably pairing mode. So I'll check that out here in just a minute. Also, before we sync it with the app, I wanted to show you the back side of the box. It just tells you some additional information about how uh, the Magic Band works, how you can cut it down or take out the, uh, the icon there. It also shows you about how to uh, unlock interactive experiences, and the QR code helps you to learn more, tells you how to recharge, all that good stuff, and then all the warning stuff on the back. So, all right, there you go. All right, so I'm on the My Disney Experience app. Just scroll down until you get to the place that says Magic Band Plus. I tap on Learn More. All right, and so then it talks about how the Magic Band Plus works, golden sculptures and all that good stuff. And you can watch some videos here about that. I'm not going to uh, go into that right now, but you can see very easily how to, how to do that and with all kinds of video help. So you've got also um, a little information about the Batu Bounty Hunters game. So definitely can't wait to try that. The Disney Fab 50 quest with all the, the golden sculptures and then the enhanced fireworks. So then you can browse 
the latest styles online and things like that. You can actually shop right there from the app. And then it tells you, um, you can link a Magic Band, view Magic Bands, and more Magic Band support. So I'm going to click on link a Magic Band. All right, how does it work? So you can tap a Magic Band Plus, hold your Magic Band card near your device to pair to your phone. All right, so we're going to click down here to open scanner. Ready to scan. Hold the card close to your device. Let's see if it's working. Maybe I need to push the, I'm going to push the button here just to see if it, um, there we go. I did it. Okay, then it gives you the option to assign the magic band to a guest. So I'm going to push, obviously assign it to me and then push continue. Pair to get the most out of your magic band. Find the button on the back of the band. Hold down the band, hold down for three seconds and release. The band will vibrate and pulse blue. Pair to enjoy more fun. All right, so let's try that real quick. So we're going to hold down the button. We're going to go one, two, three. It, it actually vibrated. Pairing in progress. Magic Band would like to pair. Looks like it's doing it. Hopefully. Pairing complete. That was easy. Final step. Make sure your Magic Band is fully charged and updated to enjoy new and exclusive experiences. So let's update it. Wow, I didn't know you had to update the Magic Band, but we can do that. Update the Magic Band. So let's see here. So it goes into your Magic Bands and more, so you tap it right there, update the Magic Bands. All right, so I got a Fireworks Magic Band. It says Updates Available. All right, so let's go ahead and hit Update. All right, so there's uh, an update available, and so it may take up to three minutes, so we're gonna download and install. Wow, it's like really colorful while it does it. Installing update, we'll see what happens when it's done. All right, so we're back and it's up to date. It really did take about three minutes, but no worries. Glad it's up to date. It did flash blue and restart and do all that stuff, so then it was done. So we're gonna hit close and uh, it tells me, if I look at my Magic Band, it tells me it's up to date, it's paired, and then it asks about light up theme. Let me go up here and see. All right, so we can change color. Let's see what different themes we can do. Special themes, fireworks. Okay, so we'll probably keep it where it is for fireworks, but then you can do all different kinds of colors here. It's pretty cool. So we'll probably keep it as the fireworks theme, I guess. All right, let's go into settings. So band light, obviously you're gonna want it, the band light on, that's the whole fun part. Uh, you can reduce brightness if you want, you can turn on and off vibration, and it says motion recognition, your band will be more sensitive to your movements during interactive experiences. Uh, so I guess when you're waving your wrist around to try and get uh, your band to interact with the different um, things in the park. If you don't want to wave as much, you can increase that. Connected park experiences. If turned off, your band will not be able to access Bluetooth enabled experiences in the park. Okay. So yeah, so not a lot of settings, but just the basics there. That works nicely. All right, everybody. Well, that's all for now for this Magic Band Plus unboxing and setup video. I hope this was helpful and I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, this little Magic Band is really cool. I've got it on my wrist now. Um, it looks nice. It's actually pretty comfortable. It's not a whole lot bigger, you know, than my Apple Watch, so so that's not too bad. But so anyway, um, I'll probably wear it in the parks uh, for a while and see how it goes and see if I enjoy using it and how it interacts with things. It would be cool if it eventually interacts with rides too. So we'll see how they do with that. But either way, um, hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know if you have any questions or if you uh, have any comments about it. Um, this one, by the way, was forty five dollars. I believe if you get one that's just the Mickey ears without the, um, you know, the extra, obviously there's fireworks and tons of decorations. If you get just the plain Mickey ears, Magic Band Plus, and you know, whatever different color you want, uh, those are $35, so that's the pricing on them. So they're not too bad. Uh, I wanted the extra design, so I didn't mind paying the extra $10, but I feel like it's it's not too bad. If it was more expensive, I probably wouldn't do it, but for $35 or $45, it's a lot of fun, and then you can, you know, easily tap through 
uh, whether it be into your resort room or uh, you know lightning lanes or even into the park um, you know makes it really really easy obviously everybody's used magic band but this one's got the extra benefit of doing the interactive experiences with the characters in the parks uh, the 50th statues, I mean, and then the Batu experience, as well as the glowing with the fireworks. So a lot of fun, and I can't wait to try it out more as we go along. So thanks for watching, everybody. Be sure to check out our awesome sponsors, Mickey Blog and MickeyTravels.com. They can help you plan your awesome trip to Walt Disney World. Also, be sure to check out the Funk Collection, RealtyInOrlando.com. Uh, if you're thinking about moving to Central Florida, the Funk Collection, RealtyInOrlando.com, they will hook you up and find you your dream home here in Central Florida. And finally, if you'd like to rent a DVC room for a fraction of the cost, check out Davis DVC Rentals at dvcrequest.com slash TV. All right, everybody, see you next time. So for now, have a great, big, beautiful tomorrow. Bye-bye. Now that you've finished watching this video, be sure that you're subscribed so that you can get all of the latest updates. Also, check out some other great videos on our channel. Have a great, big, beautiful tomorrow. Bye-bye.